Hi everyone, this is Irina and I want to share with you my latest project what I made for... Uh, I am participated in um, Swap uh, Alter Wine Cork and the uh, goal was to alter two wine corks and paper bag and send it to your partner. So, this is what I came with. Um, my idea was to make some color what kind of like neutral color so it will match with any project so I decided to stay with silver and gold. So this is my two uh that I will make this way. And so this is my two um wine corks. This is how it's turned. So let me explain what I was doing. So it's regular wine cork and I put lace under, see I put lace under and then I had this, um, it's kind of like based for pin, or for bra, bra, um, brush, you can make your own brush, so I um, attached this uh, back part and I um, bend it around this cork and so it was based and then on the top of that I put little bouquet and I was using my own um, uh, f um, lightweight uh, clay I was using my own flowers what I was making so it's any kind of flowers I create and I was using them and I made little steam, uh, um, pin and leaves and uh, I want to be sure when my uh, uh, the this stuff on the bottom will stay and it's not uh, fell down uh, like time after so what I did uh, if you will see here inside it's actually I was using this pin so you know it's basic pins that you can purchase in Juan and the floor sections it's three inches pin so and I cut a little bit this pin and uh, it's almost all pin came through my uh, cork just I cut a little bit so and I was in this go through this um, beads uh, bit some space and bead and other bit space and then almost all the way up to the end so it's definitely will stay and even if you will try to pull it's not going on and I made my own little uh, bit uh, chains or whatever and on in the back I tried to cover this lace even if it's pretty I thought oh I want it and it looks kind of like in here from from both sides so I was using my own, so usually what I do, I, I made a lot of things like this, so for purpose I can use it for my Christmas embellishment or something, so it's any kind of color and size and shape, so I was using one of them, it's actually very easy to make and it looks very cute. So I was using this on the back and of course like uh, regular pins on the top so you can see cork here and this is silver and gold looks similar like that it's the same idea I just made them mirror so if you will look they kind of like mirror each other so and of course I was using I, instead to the of uh, these flowers I was using I'm roses flowers and middle and uh, same uh, stick pin uh, but gold top and to cover this thing so I was using like this regular uh, pin uh, space and I think it's turned nice so um, you can see cork through and on the top I make I wanted to make it a little bit more goldish so I had this um, flat it's also I think you can use it for any kind of embellishment or something so it's very soft very you can bend it very easy much more easy than this part so and I bend this I think I was using um, yeah I was using square shape like this and so I bend it around my cork and it's turned nice 
and of course I made it so on the back I didn't cover this because when you look you can see chain, a key on the back so it's kind of like something's going on in the back and it's a lot of things going on on the top so I did my own beads and I put little goldish chain here and so this is how my two pins looks like so hopefully it will work with any project or with Christmas or almost, I, I think it will go with anything. So this is it. And I'm going to put this, um, um, this pins in this bag. So what actually match to this bag and I, I made my, so let me explain you about this bag. So. This is how my paper bag I uh, turned um, and I was using like regular regular bag so it was absolutely um, like bag and um, so instead of using fabric I choose I put these beads uh, tops beads tops and um, I put like a um, uh, all around and uh, I start in the middle and finished in the middle so my cut is under that flower so you cannot see where it is attached so I made this um, um, fabric flower rose it's very easy just curl and curl and curl around and I had a white um, I am roses flowers paper flowers so I kind of like um, Paint them a little bit, just give them a little bit a uh, shade of pink. And this is my stick pin, what I made, and it's all beads. Um, and then I put this uh, pretty uh, uh, applique or embroidery applique on the bottom, two actually of them. And this is bead again, and I uh, attach these two beads together and sew because it has hole here and here so I was able to sew this bead to this uh, applique and I did same thing with all beads because the beads will not stay nicely on this paper because you can bend this back and everything so I'm sure beads will go out will, will, will go will um, fall down so I sew them to these leaves and this is a little thing here and I put Kami here so this is like bags looks like okay I'm gonna show you a little bit more and of course all these goodies I'm not showing goodies because I want then I just I just pick up a nice bag so it's all match I just uh, was watching um, video of my partner and I discovered that she likes uh, a pink color then so this is why I pick up pink bag and uh, package for her so what I'm going to do uh, this um, I made this whole holder for my um, wine cork match exactly with my pay with my bag so I'm going to put these things through this little hole that I made it before I attach these two pieces, it's heavy paper under. And then I'm going to make a little bow and tie them so and put this in plastic so it will stay nice. And hopefully I will ship it uh, from Japan to my partner. So hopefully it will stay nice by the time when she will receive it. This is it. This is all my project for this uh, uh, for this um, wine cork, what was hosted by Cynthia, the scrappy book warm one. And leave me comments, guy, and tell me what do you think about my little project. And I wish you all have a good day.